I think that the word litterbug is the most benign, pussy-whipped sounding word that we could have come up with to describe someone who is essentially the perpetrator of a heinous crime against society. Litterbug is just a cute sounding word, okay? When I hear the word litterbug, I'm thinking of a sweet little litterbug, like a little fuzzy-wuzzy little thing that my little niece can curl up with in bed and go to sleep with. On the other hand, when I hear the word rapist, uh, that person's not coming anywhere near my niece. I know exactly what they did and I know exactly the level of scumbaggery that I'm dealing with. We don't say rapey bug. No, litterbug is a word that lacks gravitas, okay? It diminishes the seriousness of the crime. It makes littering sound like less of an offense and more like an irritation, like a mild case of uh, herpes or something like that. Yeah, but, but littering is a crime. It's a serious crime. You are messing with publicly owned space. I mean, if somebody walked into my home and threw litter on the floor, I would call them a lot of names. Litterbug, not one of them. Yeah. But the same person goes out in the street or into a park and does the exact same thing. All of a sudden, we're calling them litterbugs. We should call them litterbuggers. Yeah, because that's what they're doing. They're running around buggering everything up. Yeah, of course I think they should be punished. I think litter buggers should be punished within an inch of their lives. You know what we should do? We should get all of the police that are currently on helmet and seatbelt duty. Because you know what? If you don't want to wear a helmet or a seatbelt, go die. I mean, that person's not even really bothering me in any way. So let's take the cops and have them use their valuable time looking instead for litter buggers and punishing them because those guys are messing with my vibe.